everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Ruth Ann and you've reached Ruth Ann's Creations. So I am back in Florida and it was like Christmas because all the package I've been sending to myself have been coming here. So I thought I'd open all my packages with you. Full disclosure though, I opened everything and I have it laid out here on the table. I opened it because I didn't want to make all that rustling and rattling paper and if people don't like it, but anyway. Let's see what I got. Okay. First thing first, Amazon. These are my Amazon things. But it's all craft related, so that counts as something, right? I got off of Amazon 12 millimeter eyes. And this this company on um, Amazon, I use them a lot. Because I never have any trouble with their, their eyes. Uh, their backings are pretty good. It's just... You know, but that's the name of the company, but it is right on Amazon if you look up the safety eyes. They have all the different sizes. And then for the craft shows this season, I bought myself a power bank. And this is, um, this comes with a three-year warranty. And it's the BI dash, it's the B1-B41. Um, it's the Power Paw Slim. And it's got the dog on the front why I want a little dog print. That's why I liked it. And it's red, so I can't lose it because I lose so much shit that it's not even funny. So, yeah. And then I bought the Mama Made Minis Knotted Lovelies with this spiral bound. Now, this, it says that it's $21.99 in the U.S. and $28.99 in Canada, but on Amazon, this is like $18. Oh. It smells good. It's it's not like I, I couldn't rip this if I tried, which is good for me. I mean, the pages are all paper. You can rip those. But I got the spiral because I didn't want to break the binding. And I wanted to stay open. And with my luck, every time I bought like a just like a soft cover, it wouldn't stay open. It would try to close. So I got this and I can't wait to try some of them, especially since my niece is a, um, she's a nonverbal autistic and she's got Pico. So I'm really, and, and I brainstormed with my sister and we decided that when I make the head, we're going to stuff it with some old shirts. We're just going to cut them down in like big long strips and then stuff the head that way. That way if she does pull something out. She's going to get a big, long piece of fabric and not something that she can swallow. I also bought, now, I'm not home to show everyone, but the renovation that I started on my house, well, it's almost done. And my husband had tasked me with making curtains. So, I'm going to try some granny squares. So, I bought this granny square um, source book. And this has a hundred unique granny squares and 23 designers make it. Now, I haven't really gone through and looked, looked, but um, this book was not very much on Amazon. I don't remember how much it was, but it says it's $24.95 in US and $33.95 in Canada. And I did not pay that much on Amazon. Um, it was under $20. So, and this, it's a soft cover. But I like it. I mean, there's a lot. There's a lot in there. So, and in the front, I was skimming the front of it. And in the front, it tells you how to read these type of graphs that they have in here. And it also tells you how to do all the stitches. So, like a stand-up single. I didn't even know that that was a thing. Um, a stand-up triple, half triple it, it tells you everything inside of this book so I'll let you know more of a review and don't mind my hair I'm, I'm really not used to this humidity yet okay so two more there's only two more things well I bought this cup from a cup tumbler maker in Tennessee it's not a 40 it's bigger than a 40 but I love it I love the way the light catches it so, my way of helping other creators is, you know, I try to buy, if they have a free um, pattern on Instagram and they have a link to their Ravelry, 
Ravelry or their Etsy. I'll try to go there and I'll purchase the pattern because to me, especially if it's a really good one, because I feel as though they deserve to have us who appreciate the free ones. But you know, when you've got a good pattern, it, it's nice to be rewarded that way. And I think that, you know, I think everyone should make some money if they're doing stuff or I'll buy a finished project from somebody. Um, so that's how I do it. So I'm in this group called um, Handmade Buy and Sell on Facebook. And anyone could, it's it's all over the country. And all you got to look up is handmade, handmade groups on your Facebook. And I tend to look through there and I found something. And if anything, it's filled with it. It's filled with inspiration. But I did find something that I wanted. I bought from this is from bubbles and bobbles bubbles and bobbles so let's see I don't want to flash her information bubbles and bobbles and I believe she has an Etsy store and she makes soap and since I'm here at the trailer and I'm by myself I can buy all this weird stuff without Michael saying ah, what the heck is this so it came in this nice thing, had a little sticker attached to it. It came with my receipt and a handwritten note. Yes, she does have an Etsy. Now I gotta do this so you can't. I don't want you all coming to visit me all at one time in the Florida. But that's her Etsy. It's Bubbles, Bubbles and Bobbles LLC at Etsy. In case you want to take a look at that. Okay, so it came in this cute little bag. And it's a cinnamon sugar donut. <laughs> I haven't opened it yet. And the funniest thing, it says, this is not food. <laughs> I almost want to leave it in the shower for Michael to see it. But he's not, um, he hates cinnamon. And I love cinnamon. I wish it was smell-o-vision because holy Toledo. Oh. And not only that, she sent me a sample of a new scent. And this new scent is called Fall Fling. I haven't opened that. But that is so nice. She sends me a little free sample of her new scent. Wow. This smells, this smells like you're eating one of those hot cinnamon candies. Oh my gosh. This is good. If you ever watch this Bubbles and Bobbles, I'm getting this. This is the Fall Fling. And again, it's my way of, you know, I, I bought a lot of stuff from my YouTube friends. Um, but he, here's, here's my pet peeve when it comes to that. There are other people like me who can't always afford to be a Patreon or whatever. But we like to buy a finished project just so that, you know, we can help their journey too, you know. And this is beautiful. This is a beautiful package. Um, I think the sample of the new flavor was above and beyond. But... It's just the handwriting on the receipt that really says, you know, that they, that they see me, you know, and I've ordered from other YouTubers on here, especially who have big stores and I've gotten a cup, you know, not this size, but another cup and it just came in the envelope in a box in a, um, a poly mailer. No, thank you. No. Oh, this is from, thanks for your order. Nothing. Nothing. And I bought from another huge YouTuber that I bought from their Etsy. And I only knew it was from them because it said on the front of the label. And I knew what I ordered. So, again, I've ordered from 
other YouTubers where I've gotten my item and a thank you card. You know, what's wrong with sending a little thank you card? Or not so much a thank you, but uh, uh, it doesn't have to be a thank you card. It can be their business card. Let me get to something else I bought. Ladies and gents, if you don't buy anything else in this world for your craft, buy this one thing. Buy this one thing and tell them Ruthann sent you. I'm not sponsored by them, by the way, so you don't get anything off. But This is a Canadian-based company, and it's called B, as in boy, W-A Wood Turning. Wait till you see this. Now, again, I didn't want to crinkle on the thing. So, it came in a little envelope because it's Canadian base. It had a little sticker on the back. And then three business cards with their stuff on the back. My receipt with a handwritten note, which wasn't necessary because I got a card so I know who they're from and I know what the product is, but it's this extra little bit and all it says is thank you and that we hope you love your new item. Like It probably took her two minutes, but to me, it means the world to me because they're a small company just like these other people that I shall not name, but here it is. Look at this hook. Now when you order these hooks, they take a piece of wood in the resin, it's already done, and they turn it to be the handle you want, and this is the best part, okay? It comes with every hook size, every one. So if you want another one, you just put it in, tighten up this piece. They call it the, um, call it, I call it C-O-L-L-E-T. And there you go. And they're all, I hope you can see this, but it might be too little. But they are all numbered, so you know, um, you know, it's a 4.0 or whatnot, and they come in this little black bag. Woo! That I just broke. I'll fix it. I'll fix it. But this, this is stunning. Absolutely. I mean, look at the glitter in that. Absolutely stunning. I mean, now I saw this off of another YouTuber, and when I seen hers, I'm like, oh my god, I have to turn it, I have to have it, I have to have one. So I seen this color and it was out of stock, but the big thing about their site is if you see something and they don't have it, tell them you, that you know, just send them a note, they answer right away, I couldn't believe it. They, she answered right away. And she said, I have one left. And she showed me the block that was going to be this hook. And I fell in love. And the prices are not very bad. Um, I paid $60, $60 or $61. I mean, that's still high for one hook. But if you go to like Burl's Crochet, they're all the same. They're the same, same price range. Maybe even, a, I think... The ones I got might have been a little bit more. But this is awesome, and they are a small company. Shipping did not take that long. I got it within a week. They tell you when it's being shipped out. Uh, they do special requests. If there's a special color you want, I had already pre-ordered the next the next hook that's coming in uh, when they get an, uh, another shipment of bases. I mean, look at that. It's so smooth and it came with a little bag of pieces and then the directions on how to use how to take the collet off they're phenomenal phenomenal again that's B is a boy WA wood turning they're on Facebook Instagram 
And then they have their online website. And again, they message you right back. Or if you message them on Instagram, they message right back. And then I get some other silly things, but they're not crochet lady related. So it won't help you. So this weekend we are setting up at an event with my dip mixes, crochet, and my sister is doing, my baby sister does bracelets. So I'll make sure to take a video and send that to you. Well, I'll put it out on YouTube and hopefully, hopefully, You'll come back and you'll watch that video too. So if you're not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and subscribe. I think the button's down here. Hit that button. If you hit the little bell, it tells you when I've uploaded a video, which I'm gonna try to be better at uploading. Uh, I have some project ideas I wanna come up with. So there's that. And thanks for checking in. Thanks for coming back. And if you're new here, thanks for being here. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Next time, if you'd rather I leave everything in the packages, I will. I don't mind. I just didn't want to make all the, the ruckus. But I can for next time. If there is next time. I don't know. I might stop spending for a little bit. And I got my Wawa coffee. One in Florida. Right? The nearest Wawa from my house is like four hours. That's ridiculous. So, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye for now.